Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Russian Fishing. And we are still here at Quarry Lake doing some char grinding. The weather lately has been perfect for it. And we're going to come over here and start doing a circumnavigation, but I basically go around the outer skirts of the entire lake, around the Cursed Island and troll for these guys and I've been having a, a lot of luck with these Karuni 2-001's two, two or whatever 13 ounce had a few viewers talking to me earlier asking what I was using because I keep pulling the char in and I told them about it so I hope I helped them out a little bit so we're going to go ahead and get these out set out here and make some rounds around this lake and see if they're still biting. Alright, looks like we got one, first one. And he is not a small little fish. I've got pretty heavy duty line on here, so I can afford to have the tension up quite a bit, a little bit, mostly to save time. But occasionally I do get one that's kind of powerful, so I always make sure I back off if that occurs. It seems like most of what I've been getting though have been char, actually Arctic char, and. Occasional quarry char, char and a lot of lake trout. But the lake trout have been varying in size, and of course, you're always going to get perch and some other odds and ends like vendaces. Boy, this is going to take a while to get him in here. Let's see what he is, guys. Yep, lake trout, 954, 2.863 kilograms. Not a bad fish. Very nice start. Now a lot of times you're traveling through here, you're going to be not catching anything. So that's what ends up happening with me. So I'll probably be cutting these parts out. This is not one long stretch, guys. This is this may be a couple of days worth of, of playing. Not days as in real days, but in-game days. We're going to head around this little point over here. Seems like I get a lot of char right here, though, for some reason. We are headed straight down this way, and I find that if I follow this path... There we go. Got one. I always seem to get a lot of these, these guys. Especially on cloudy and partly cloudy days. Sunny, it's not as well, honestly. So usually I do something else on sunny days. Let's see what we got here. Well, I can't seem to get him out of the water. <laughs> Come on. What is the deal? I'm going to try the net. I think it's because we're moving. Oh, I've got another one on that one, too. Jeez. See if we can get him in here. Stop the engine. There we go. Oh, he's just a little bitty. That is hardly worth the trouble. Hmm, what's this? Arctic char. There you go. 1.258 kilograms. And he's not a trophy of any kind, though. So he won't be worth a whole lot, but... They are here. It really strikes me as odd because it's not really that deep here compared to some other areas. I would have thought they'd be more in the deep locations, but 
Hard to say. Fish are where you find them. Alright, let's get this going again. But yeah, it's usually... There we go again. See what I mean? This area is just real active. The only thing is you got to be careful because there are some pike and if you don't... You always chance chance getting a bit off. Ooh, nice seven trout. Three, six, ten. One point eight five seven kilograms. That's a nice trout. I haven't gotten one of these for a little while. All right, it's set. Get her moving again. Yeah, the weather seems to be going back and forth between cloudy and partly sunny. As you can see, we're still heading that same direction at that channel. The only thing is, it seems like these engines are so loud that you can't always hear. Like I said, there you go. Oh, whoa, oh, wow. There we go. Yeah, he's gonna... Okay, he's gonna be a little bit of trouble to get in. Yeah, sometimes if I get a really long fight, I put pauses in it just because literally it can take 15, 20, even 30 minutes to pull one of these guys in if they're really good size. But I think he's coming, so. Well, maybe. Damn, he is strong. Each time I keep getting him close, he pulls like a son of a gun. And I don't want him to get the mess up the reel if he starts pulling too fast. It starts getting hot. Oh. Well, okay. It's got it can take him at full tension. Maybe we can just muscle his butt in. I think I've got like 30 pound or maybe 40 pound test. I don't remember. Oh yeah, it's going to get him in. Awesome. Just got to remember, if he starts to bolt real hard, to take the tension off real fast. There we go. Nice. 4.411 pound arctic char. Or 5,000 XP. Not bad, not a bad fish at all. Go ahead and get a picture of him. Yeah, we're still early in the game, so we're getting like the um, early bird XP or whatever. Whoops. There we go again. Got another good one. I love this rod. It is so flexible. Yeah, I don't think he's quite as big as that last fish. Yeah, C-145, he's kind of a little fella. Got another one in this one too. Okay, this one's bigger than that other one. 
I love these two rods. They're really, really good medium level rods. And we're not talking, they're not like carp rods by any means, but they hold up pretty well. Okay, this guy's decent size. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's coming in. Well, maybe not. <laughs> Alright, we're just going to have to be real careful. He's a bolter. I have a feeling he's a lake trout just because of the way he's bolting. No! Damn! That's a big 7 trout. 2.874 kilograms. Oh, almost five and a half thousand XP points, guys. Yeah, I'm definitely going to picture him. I don't see me catching anything much bigger than that right now. <laughs> That's a nice fish. Yeah, I think the quarry char, though, are the highest in XP and cash. Don't... I don't swear to them, but I think they are. But I think the seven trout are right after them. You get a lot of cash for them as well. Damn. Somebody sending me a message. <laughs> well, dude, I'm afraid you're gonna have to wait because I am not gonna pause. Because whatever this is, it's decent size. him in pretty far and he just started bolting. I thought maybe I had him in. He might be bigger than I thought he was. Come on. I can see him. There he is. I think he's an Arctic Char. Jeez. Okay, he's going to make a run for it. Something tells me I've got a fight on my hands, guys. This is going to be one of those long, stretched fights. Yep. Alright, three in-game hours almost. <laughs> well, maybe about two, but still a while. But he is finally coming in. It's dark. I wish you could light these boats up a little bit better. But I think we've got him in. He is still fighting me, go. tell you. Yeah, I think it was 2,300 hours when I started this. It's now almost 2 in the morning. He is definitely coming now. Almost there. Okay, we got him. We got him. Whoa! 5.348 kilograms, 6,150 XP. Arctic char. Ooh, definitely worth the fight. 
Alright guys, I am sorry. I had to leave for a little bit. Looks like I got a bite already. But I had to go help my wife with something, so now it is morning. It doesn't take long, long for time to advance in this game if you leave for a little bit. You had to get the laundry out. <laughs> Alright, we've almost got this guy in, but I'm not sure what he is, but he is really testing my rod here. Come on. Almost there. Ooh, Kawari Char. Holy crap. 9,533 XP, 4.237 kilograms. Definite picture. Definite picture. Nice fish. See what I mean about the points? Yeah, they are just serious cash, serious XP. You don't catch them that much, but when you do, they're well worth it. Arctic chars. Are worth it. Lake trout, you don't get as much for them unless they're really big. But they do bring a little cash in. Seven trout bring in good cash as well. Eat me a little hot cake there because I'm getting a little famished. Yeah, it's like in every game, I always forget to eat. <laughs> I just get so excited. Okay. All's quiet. We're making the circle right here. Usually this time I don't get as many bites as it gets later in the evening though. But at least it's still partly cloudy. It's been switching back and forth. Now based on the weather report I've been checking for this, uh, it's supposed to rain in the next day on this game. So that changes everything usually rain means burbot burbo or whatever the hell they call them apparently you don't pronounce the T I didn't know that sorry about that we are gonna come back around here like we did earlier like that time we cut all those char one right after another We better keep an eye on these rods because it's usually right around here they start picking up. Right over this hole. Yeah, I'm going to pause it for a minute. Let the lines drop down. Sometimes that gets their attention. There we go. Yeah, we definitely got one here. Let's see what he is, guys. Uh, he looks bigger than you think he is. Lake trout. He's kind of small. Won't get much for him. I've actually been catching a lot of other species while I've been doing this, but most of them have been things like perch, and they've been so small that they're just kind of negligible. Mm, 
There might be something on this. Yep, we got another one there. Them dates, huh? Getting quite a few of those, too. A little bitty fish, though. Occasionally you get one of some significance, but even then they're small. Okay, let's see what we got here. Thinking it's a lake trout. Yep, 837, 2.512 kilograms. All right. Starting to get later in the day again. I'm gonna grab a little alcohol here. Uh, sh what is that? She? She? I'm not sure how you pronounce that. Looks good. We've got a little fish on here. I'm pretty sure. My no, it's a little quarry char. <laughs> little bitty one. Unfortunately, not much points there. They are a pretty fish. So bright red. Yeah, usually once we get close to these weeds and stuff, that's when we start getting things like perch. Alright, I think we're going to swing this around one more time. Ooh, oh crap. Just because that keeps happening when I do that. Nice. This is a nice one. Oh boy, he is definitely testing my line here. Oh shoot. Yep, got back off. Looks like we got a fight, guys. Nothing wrong with a little fight. Yep, we gotta get that tension down because could be very problematic. Now the line would definitely break before anything else did, but no sense risking that. It always amazes me how much the alcohol raises all your levels up. <laughs> it makes you feel really good. Let's see. <laughs> yeah, he's coming now. Won't be too long. He's probably at another 50 yards or so, I would imagine. <coughs> yeah, I think I might have to get the net for this one because this is a big fish. And if he decides to bolt, right as I get him close to the... Yeah, see what he's trying to do there? Get over here, you pain him. Got him. Oh, that's a nice fish. 5.951 kilograms 7527 XP nice 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 and I got another one on this one too see what I mean about this area guys got to try it without a doubt just go around this area just like I did and completely circle around in Lake Trout at 684 total 752 not too bad 
Not too bad at all. Yeah, we are doing really well here, guys. Yeah, I bet we're easily pulling in 200 silver or so. It's starting to rain now. Yeah, I think the weather's going to turn against us here. Which means we probably might need to move this inside. Call it an episode. Yep, it is definitely getting worse. Alright guys, that is it. It got dark and I'm done. So we are going to come in and check our catch. See what we got here. Cash wise. Providing I can get the heck out of the boat and not crash it. There we go. And always, as I always say, check the cafe first. After you run into the post. <laughs> and... Let's see, anything here that might... No? What about the lake trout? Ooh! Yeah! Well, how much is that going to get? 92.0... Well, that's better I'd get just by selling them. Yep, we're going to go ahead and do that. We're going to highlight all of them and sell those suckers as quick as we can here. That's 92, and I haven't sold the others yet. Not bad. Let's check over here and see what the rest of them are worth. Oh, man. Some nice scores here, guys. Yeah, that quarry char is worth a lot. Actually, all the char are worth at least around 30 or more. That's 24 for that one. Yeah, this isn't bad, guys. Not bad at all. Let's highlight all of them. Looks like 190.74. That's not bad. That makes almost 300 silver just for about an hour real real time of work there. Not bad. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll be back with another episode. So until then, guys, always remember, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I'll see you later. Bye-bye.